Stop overthinking it and just do it. Stop overthinking it and just do it. Welcome to the Daily Genius. I am Dr. Will. Welcome back to the nation. Thank you so much for joining me. For those of you that are not inside our private Facebook group called Genius Nation, I encourage you to join our group. It's a thriving group with over a thousand individuals that just want to be better, just want to improve on themselves and become the best versions of themselves. It's a free group. Just go to Facebook, join us inside the nation. So good morning, nation. Welcome back to another episode of The Daily Genius. If you've been tuning in and following us, you've know I've committed to doing 365 videos over the next year. I believe we we started, this is episode number um, eight, I believe. So we started eight days ago. So we have a whole lot of whole lot of time to go. And the whole purpose of this is twofold. Number one, I wanted to challenge myself to go to another level of discipline. So definitely this is a, another level of discipline for myself um, to show up every single day for 365 days. The second part is I want to just kind of give you a behind the scenes of how I run my life, how I run my business. And along the way, you pick up some wisdom, some insights and some tools, some strategies and some systems to help you run your life in your business or career better. So that's the whole purpose of the daily genius. Um, and as I was thinking this morning, um, as I shared with you before, some of these will be live and some of these will be pre-recorded based upon my schedule. Like today, um, I have a class. I'm, I'm doing a training this morning at the same time as we post the Daily Genius, which is seven o'clock here in Arizona. So I'm pre-recording this. It's still Saturday morning. It's 640. So um, we're about I'm. 20 minutes early because I have to start the other training. And I just want to be transparent with you and share those types of things with you because a lot of times we kind of wonder how are people doing stuff and we kind of mystify it and we try, we make it more difficult than it really is. So, man, I, man, I'm on a training with Dr. Will at seven, but he's also doing the daily genius at seven. How is he doing that? So I want to demystify all of that for you because a lot of times that is what stops us from getting started. So I just wanted to share this with you, this little thought. Um, whenever you get ready to do something, one of the things that I'm liking is this whole process for myself. Like once again, this is a discipline and this is a challenge for me to make sure I show up um, at 7 a.m. every morning. I already know kind of what the journey is going to look like. Some days I'm going to be motivated to do it. Some days I'm not, but I'm still going to do it. And this is what I've learned about the process, right? The process. Whenever you get ready to go do some things, like if you want to lose weight, if you want to write the book, if you want to start a business, whatever it is that you want to do, there's a, there's a process of how it looks, right? And here it is. At first, it's going to be extremely hard, right? You're going to have to get over yourself. You're going to have to get things in place or whatever that may be. So it's going to be extremely hard because we're changing behaviors. We're changing behaviors. And then it's going to get like messy. It's going to get real messy, right? Because then you're going to have outside factors that are coming in um, intentionally, unintentionally trying to distract you. But then at the end, it's going to be beautiful. It's going to be beautiful. So even for myself, as I look at this journey that we're on, you know, I'm rearranging my life. I'm making sure I'm looking at my calendar. Um, can I show up at seven? You know, all this type of stuff. That's that's hard. The thought about it, thinking about it 365 days every single day. That's a hard thought. Then it gets messy. Right. And so even after we've done it for a week now, I'm starting to get my rhythm. I kind of know, you know, Internally, it's interesting because I just want to have a conversation with you guys. But at the same time, my mind is telling me, oh, it has to be this. It has to be that. So I'm, I'm really trying not to overthink it. Right. Um, not really worrying about my lighting and all that type of stuff. I just want to serve. I just want to serve you guys for 365 days 
uh, this year and just give you content that's going to help you. So even thinking about that, um, the content that I'm going to share with you, um, how much of it needs to be intentional. I'm trying to really think about my life and, and just really unpack my life and, and find areas of value for you, what's going to be valuable to you. And then at the end of the journey, it's going to be beautiful, right? This is like episode number eight. Um, episode number 50 is going to be a lot better. Episode number 100 is going to be a lot better. Episode number 200 is going to be a lot better. So it's going to get beautiful. It's This is going to be a, a an amazing place. Um, we're going to have you know, hours of hours of content for you to go back to and reference. And um, it's just going to be a beautiful journey. So just remember in anything, it's hard at first, it's messy in the middle, and then it's beautiful at the end. So just keep thinking about that end journey and what that end journey is going to be like. But the major thing is, whatever it is, you got to get started. I always use the analogy if there's something wrong with your car, let's say you ran out of gas and you're on the side of the road and you're just sitting in your car, well, all the other cars are going to just keep passing by because they don't know why you're sitting in your car. Are you sitting in your car because you're taking a nap? Are you sitting in your car because you're taking um, a phone break? Are you sitting in your car for some other reason? They don't know. It's only when you get out your car and start pushing it on the road that people say, oh, you need help. Oh, let me let me pull over and assist you, right? That's what doing the work does for you. As you begin to do the work, there's other people that will see you doing the work and they'll have some expertise that can come in and help you. So I already know, you know, um, if we explore and want to take the daily genius and make it different and, and, and do a whole different, this may mushroom into something else. I don't know. But what I do know is just by me doing it, something good is going to happen from it, right? Something good is going to happen. I don't know actually what's going to end up happening, but I just know when you put good intention out into the world, good things are going to happen to you. So that's what I wanted to share with you this morning, Nation. I hope it helps you out, gives you something to think about. Go out there this weekend and, and do something uh, amazing, something that makes you smile, something that makes you laugh. And I'll see you back here tomorrow for the Daily Genius. All right, guys, have a great day.